defense. And by, I by the way, you know, ruled. one of the striking things in Chazen, the prosecutor comes in front of you and says, this is the prosecutor's argument at this point. And the prosecutor says, I understand from my experience before your honor, your honor's objection, policy objections to the, to the 2G 2.2 sentencing guidelines. And he goes on to say, however, in this case in particular, the four point specific offense characteristic is justified because it contains sadomasochistic images of infants and toddlers. I'm trying to understand how you see someone that possesses images of infants and toddlers being sexually violated and you sentence them to 64% below what the prosecutor is asking for. You're, you're, you, you don't provide a justification other than a generic concern that the guidelines are too high. You don't provide a justification as required by statute. So I'm asking you to take the opportunity to explain to this committee and the American people why in 100% of the cases, you have people with vile crimes, and you have language saying they're vile crimes, but then you sentence them to very, very low sentences. And, and why do you consistently, 100% of the time, choose to do that? Senator, no one case can stand in for a judge's entire sentencing record. I've sentenced more than 100 people. You have eight or nine cases okay. in that chart. Okay, Judge, you said that before. The, these are the eight or nine child porn cases. I will say to correct the record, I'm I just talking say about to the judge, there's no point in responding. He's going to interrupt you. I, Thank you. Look, I appreciate the chairman trying to filibuster. And if you don't like your witness's answers, you're, you're welcome to provide your own. Uh, she, she is declining to answer the question. And, and Chairman Durbin, if you want to join her on the, on the, on the bench, you can. But I, Chairman Durbin. Uh, my job is to make Chairman sure Durbin, I'm not interrupting answer. your questioning. I'm asking you to give her a chance to answer. But she's consistently said she's not going to answer. I want to clarify for the record, by the way, the case I was discussing was Cooper and not Chazen. 